Today we're gonna create a Zentangle Easter Bunny using pencil and Sharpie and some color. As you can see, my paper is smaller than a regular paper. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold your paper once, fold it again, and then you're gonna cut it. So we're gonna use one out of the four pieces of paper that you're gonna get. And we're gonna save the other three for another art project. Now we're ready to start drawing. We're gonna begin with that middle circle and then continue with the head. Remember to erase and fix it as many times as you need. It's okay to make mistakes, it's part of the process. Now we're gonna add some ears, some details, the rest of the body. We're gonna add these big circles, half circles for the eyes. Remember this is an abstract bunny, it's not like a real bunny, so it doesn't matter if it doesn't look exactly like a real bunny. And then you're gonna start adding your patterns. As you can see, the one I'm doing right now is different than the, the sample one that I did. So that's the idea that you get creative and choose any patterns you want and see what happens. The fun thing about Zentangle is that you can add many different patterns and that gives dynamic to your drawing. So my suggestion is divide your drawing into sections and then add different patterns. So that makes your composition a lot more interesting and fun. Once you finish adding all the details to your bunny, you're gonna color the background and then trace all the lines using a Sharpie or a black pen. You can use a thin Sharpie or a thick Sharpie to add variety. And don't forget to sign your name at the bottom of your work. <music> 